Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Living in the Red Dot. This is May, and if you don't know where the Red Dot is, that would be sunny and humid Singapore. So today, I'd like to share with you an overview on my collection of Victor and Wolf uh, fragrances. Um, for those of you who don't know, Victor and Wolf are a couple of uh, Dutch haute couture designers. So in 2005, they have released a very popular perfume, Flower Bomb. And since then, they just keep having like more and more uh, perfumes uh, that are produced in the market. Two popular collections that they have is the Flower Bomb Collection and the Bonbon Collection. And they have released other fragrances for the men's collection as well and, um, and others. So like I said, in 2005, they started uh, with Flower Bomb by Victor and Wolf. Um, this is a very sweet uh, gourmand-like fragrance. It's floral, but it is sweet. It was not um, love at first uh, scent for me, but I grew to love it nevertheless. And then, starting in 2009, they started to release an annual annual uh, flower bomb, La Vie en Rose. So every, every year they would have um, a new fragrance like this. This is the 2014 version. It would have the DNA of uh, the original flower bomb, but there will be slight tweaks. And it's definitely less uh, less overpowering than the original, so it's perfect for summer and spring. It's much lighter. 2018, they have released Flower Bomb Nectar, just this bottle right here. It is much, much sweeter than the original uh, Flower Bomb. It's almost syrupy sweet, and it is fantastic. Finally, in uh, 2019, this is the latest addition to their family, Flower Bomb uh, Midnight. You may have seen another video that I posted where I did an unboxing of this perfume. And then there is the Bonbon Collection. Uh, it started in 2014. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have that version, uh, but I did smell it once when I was at the Changi Airport. Um, it's a very, very, very caramel uh, scent. It's very sweet, uh, very much like candy, and it lasts, lasts, lasts for a long time. Um, then, in 2016, they came up with its first flanker, which is this one right here. Look at that bottle. It's gorgeous. This is the Bonbon Couture. So, it's very much like the original Bonbon but it's slightly a little bit more grounded. Um, it's still sweet and it really stays on the skin for hours and hours. Um, it's fantastic. So that's the two uh, collections uh, that they're famous for, Flower Bomb and Bonbon. Bon. But in 2009, they, they have also released this Omega right here. Um, they released this after uh, the success of Flower Bomb. However, um, the scent uh, didn't quite make quite a hit with uh, its intended audience. It's not what they expected, whereas Flower Bomb Original was so sweet. This one was more of a fruity smell. It has watermelon, watermelon-like scent, uh, aquatic, and pears, I believe. But it also lasts in the skin for quite a long time, at least on me, it does. Um, this fragrance has been discontinued, but there has been collectors out there. Uh, for those of you who are collecting, who are interested in this, I've seen it listed on you know, Singapore perfume shops for about, I think, $160. Um, and I've, I've also seen this in Amazon.ca for about 270 Canadian dollars. Um, uh, bon Bon Couture, uh, I've seen it at uh, Lucky Plaza for about $85 at Perfume Cosmetics uh, and Cosmetics Gallery. Uh, I've seen it at Sentiments, a bigger bottle for about 90 ml and it costs about 190 Singapore dollars. Uh, Midnight, 
uh, it was $60 when I bought it at Sentiments. Uh, it's around 88 I believe, in uh, Canada. Um, a flower bomb, um, the price varies, but I think here it costs about maybe close to $150 Sing dollars, but I have seen it on sale at Sentiments for about $40 for a small bottle. Uh, nectar, uh, it's about the same price in Singapore and in Canada. Uh, they're about $150. $150. So there you go. That's uh, my Victor and Rolf uh, collection. Just a quick overview. I will have follow-up videos where, where I will talk about each and um, every single perfume so you'll know more about it. Thank you. Bye. If you like this video, please hit a like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you'll know when I posted a new one. See ya!